Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to talk about cryptocurrency. So basically for those that uh, don't really know what cryptocurrency is all about, uh, probably this will be the episode for you. And um, I'll actually go through the fundamentals of how you actually spot between the actual genuine cryptocurrency and a scam. So uh, stay tuned everyone. We'll hop right into it, all right? So as you can see from my screen, basically you can see um, this is the Ethereum page. Ethereum currently is uh, just behind Bitcoin. Uh, per coin is priced about right around 2,900 USD at the current moment. So how actually cryptocurrency works is basically is like an exchange, right? So between a fiat currency and a cryptocurrency is that you can actually send this through directly to your friends and family, whether be it uh, locally or overseas, you can send and uh, complete the transaction within seconds. Unlike in the past, um, all transactions is uh, through the bank or any other third parties or any other fintech companies like PayPal and stuff like that. So uh, probably you will lose not only on the commission, but also on the exchange rate itself. Um, and uh, I would say that transaction-wise, probably it will take about a couple of days, the earliest, the quickest. Some probably might take up to weeks. I'm not too sure about that. So uh, I've actually stopped um, using uh, remittance through uh, the bank for a while now so everything is via cryptocurrency so it, it gets the transaction completed and done fast so um, never do let's take a look at ethereum so basically in ethereum you can actually see that on ether itself um, how the use of ether okay this is actually their website and learning about ether so basically all cryptocurrency has their own website and probably they will publish their own roadmap and white paper for you to understand what sort of a project or protocol they are actually into okay it's very important for you to do your own research before investing okay and uh, importantly understand try to understand what is the project all about all right I, i'm not asking <laughs> everyone to be entirely sure about uh, what they are looking at all right basically this some some involves coding some involves the concept as you can see from here you know basically the uh, bunch of numbers you know transferring from state transaction from state one to another state so I, i'm not actually asking uh, everyone to understand this all right but most importantly to go through their white papers and roadmap to see whether to be a judge to see whether are they genuine following through what they are doing and what they have promised okay so majority of these uh, crypto coins they do have their own um, social media sites they, they do have their own community you know to, to actually uh, bring the message forth okay uh, majority of these sort of cryptocurrency generating cryptocurrencies um, they don't really talk about buying ethereum okay they don't really encourage you to buy their coin but through their community, they actually let you understand what Ethereum is all about, what is their progress at the current moment, and they, they will share their links, you know, uh, sites to, to actually take you through. And of course, to share on what the upcoming events, um, meetup groups and stuff like that. So they do have their own Twitter page, you can see from below. Um, I actually put up their own Twitter page. So this is a Twitter page for Ethereum. As you can see, the Ethereum community is pretty huge. And um, every day, basically, you can see, you know, people are posting all about Ethereum, you know, the memes that are going through. And of course, there are some couple of serious talks. So the I, I would say that um, the page itself is pretty, uh, um, um, how do I say, active. All right, you need to have active members talking about it, and you don't really see, you know, uh, the community or, or the people that is actually handling uh, Ethereum, advising you to buy or, or you know, 
encouraging you to buy Ethereum to support them. Not at all. Huh? So um, I'll move forth. So on Ethereum itself, um, let, let me open up the page again. So basically on Ethereum itself, apart from understanding from their uh, group, you can actually find out who are the developers behind, all right? The, the brains behind Ethereum, you know, the what, what they're actually going through, what the fundamentals they are trying to put across the board and put together with, okay? So um, it's, it's actually the entire spectrum of how you understand a particular coin, all right? So uh, as I said again, please do your own research into investing into one. Please do not get scammed. Some of the white papers on the website on some coins, basically you can only see um, probably some cutouts from Google Docs or, or you know, uh, they'll probably copy from other coins and then just cut and paste over. Don't be scammed. Please choose your coin wisely before you invest. And uh, of course, after this video, you can do your own research, do a bit of deep diving yourself. How much do you understand what, you know, what was the coin all about? Yeah, and, and how you can actually bring forth the future. So, so cryptocurrency wise um, is more peer to peer, P to P. Okay, so you can actually send your currency across and get the transaction done within seconds itself. So in, in my next episode, basically, I will tell everyone, I will show everyone, actually, I will show everyone how you actually register yourself and get to understand how to actually trade and invest. Okay, as you can see from my screen, this is actually the Binance page. This is where I do my trading. And you can see if you click into Ethereum, you basically can see the trading view. So this is a lot more on the pro view of how trading actually works. And uh, I'll, of course, uh, in my upcoming episodes, I'll teach you, I'll teach everyone uh, how you actually look at all these charts, all right? And uh, to trade wisely, you know, um, so on and so forth. Of course, uh, Binance is not the, ex the only exchange. Uh, CoinHakul is also one. Um, which is more recognized by MAS of Singapore. Um, uh, the thing is that um, about CoinHako, okay, I, I find that their transaction fees are actually pretty expensive. So there are a couple of things to take note of. So on my next episode, I'll uh, tell everyone what to take note of, you know, what are the commission fees, what are the withdrawal fees, and what can you do with your coins that are actually on the platform itself, okay? So that's all for today. Thank you for um, watching my video. Uh, please like and subscribe. And see you in the next episode. Bye.